thanks for watching our video. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. So what is an air-cooled chiller? Air-cooled chiller units are large, typically mounted on a trailer, and interestingly, not used to cool down air, but water. Chillers use a vapor expansion and compression cycle for liquid refrigerant, meaning the refrigerant is continuously transformed from a liquid to a vapor and back again. This process cools down the refrigerant, which is passed through an evaporator. Water comes into the unit through a two to five inch radius hose and is passed over the evaporator and cooled off to the desired temperature. After that, it's returned back out through a similar hose. Some might be wondering, what do you use the cold water for? Well, unlike the water from an on-site well or city water supply, the water from a chiller is not meant for consumption. Typically, the cooled water is used for existing air handler systems, which are usually located on the roof or to the side of a building. Here's a question, why wouldn't you just put a few dozen package units on the roof instead of bothering with this water system? Well, let's take a theme park, for example. When a project calls for air conditioning multiple buildings or maybe even just one gigantic building that covers a really large area, that means you need a massive amount of AC units and you need them all to work as effectively and cost effectively as possible. That's where the team of chillers and air handlers come in. Many theme parks or similar locations keep their chillers in a building that's off the beaten path and out of sight. From here, a supply of cold water travels through a system that connects to each building's set of air handlers. These air handlers use cold Cold water, not coolant, to regulate the air temperature that they produce. Even better is that by using a chilled water system, you can even get the air temperature down to freezing if necessary. So not only can you cool off a massive area, but you can do it without having to replace coolant in individual units.